in Delhi, where Parliament, as you might know, is currently in session. And the row over the Adani Enterprises Hindenburg issue very much continues. It's expected to cause fireworks in Parliament again today. Remember, the opposition comprising primarily right now being led by the Congress and the TMC. They're protesting as we speak. You can see uh, in the middle visual on your screens right now. They're protesting in front of the Gandhi statue outside Parliament. They're holding placards. Now, what the opposition is demanding is either a joint parliamentary committee probe or a Supreme Court monitored probe into the report. The Hindenburg report, remember, came out on Jan 24th. The report made major allegations about the way in which the Adani company was handling its funds. The report alleged huge mismanagement. Um, now, I'm going to bring you more details on what the report alleged, how the opposition is responding. But first, very quickly, the Congress's Sonia Gandhi has, just a few hours ago, penned an article in the Indian Express. Now, one of the main points of the article is that she's argued that the hard-earned savings of crores of poor and middle-class Indians are being threatened. Uh, she said that LIC and SBI were forced to invest in these poorly managed companies. She's hinting, of course, at the Adani companies. Uh, she said they were owned and forced by the government because these are the government's chosen friends. This is part of what she said. Very quickly, I want to walk you through political reactions. Then we'll connect with my colleague Pallavi for more. Our demand is that the notice we have given to the 267 is that the notice should be given to us. Because this issue is not related to the Rashpati Ji's relationship. It is a different issue. That's why we want to take this issue first. And the President's issue भाषण है उसके ऊपर हम सभी लोग बोलने को तैयार है लेकिन पहला हमारा मुद्दा यह है जो आज गड़बड़ी पूरे देश में हो रही है नेशनली और इंटरनेशनली जो ये सब्जेक्ट आज उठा है इसके ऊपर मोदी जी जवाब दें हमारा मीटिंग होगी अभी विपक्ष सारे इकट्ठा होंगे विपक्ष सारे बैठ के चर्चा करके फैसला लिया जाएगा यह कोई कांग्रेस पार्टी के अकेले मुद्दा नहीं है हिंदुस्तान के आम जनता के मुद्दा है तो हमारी सबको साथ चर्चा करके ये निर्णय लिया जाएगा कि क्या करना चाहिए आजकल निर्मला सीतारामन जी को प्रधानमंत्री जी तैनात करते हैं हर बात में कम से कम ऑटोक्रेसी तो नहीं करते आज की सरकार चलता है जिसको कहते हैं कि ऑटोक्रेट और जो नियम अपनाते हैं उसको कहते हैं ऑटोक्रेसी हम मैंने निर्मला सीतारामन जी को ये सलाह देना चाहते हैं कि हिंदुस्तान में डेमोक्रेसी बरकरार रही ऑटोक्रेसी के बदले डेमोक्रेसी बरकरार रही और हिपोक्रेसी है या नहीं है ये तो सदन में पता चलेगी my colleague Pallavi Ghosh has been with us over the last few hours bringing us coverage on this entire story let's go over to her to understand more Pallavi good morning Pallavi we're playing out for our audiences uh, these visuals of the opposition joined together in their attempts to force the government into having a open discussion though the government has said in the past that they are open to such a conversation but if i just want to understand from you could you walk us through what we know is going to be the opposition's approach particularly because this is a symphony of sorts between different opposition parties that have had power struggles in the past what can we expect well to have frankly speaking in a short while from now it will cool be there to see because the house will reconvene at 11 am which means any time now and with a kind of multiple notices which have been given for suspension and adjournment of business in both the houses it's pretty much clear that opposition parties do not want to take up any matter atar other than from the hindenburg report or the adani issue in fact the word which came out of the opposition party meeting by way of sources was very clear we are not going to allow any other business to be transacted we want the house to be adjourned i only discussed this particular issue which i mean that we can see a repeat of what happened last week as well uh, of course you saw opposition protests and of course you saw a semblance of opposition unity the tmc which was absent from the meeting uh, was present there during the protest and tmc possibly is the only party which has openly and vocally maintained the point that we must allow the motion of thanks to take place because it's there where we can bang in our issues as far as the adani issue is concerned which gets recorded on the floor of the house that doesn't seem to have got much of a consensus or resonance as far as opposition meeting is concerned so when the house reconvenes any time now uh, toya you're going to see a repeat possibly of that hangama which we saw last week 
Okay, Pallavi, can I just request that you stay with us? Playing our opposition responses for our audience, this is what the Samajbadi Party MP Ram Gopal Yadav has to say. Take a look. What do you think about it? We want to say that what we have bought from the share of the State Bank of India, the money of the State Bank of India, the LIC, 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 बंद होने के कगार पर किस तरीके से ये पैसा दिया गया क्यों दिया गया किन शर्तें थी किस तरह से लोगों ने फाइलों पर लिखा अगर जांच जेपीसी की होगी तो सारी चीज हिंदुस्तान के लोगों के और दुनिया भर के लोगों के सामने आएगी इसलिए इसकी जांच होना जरूरी है अगर मनोज जी कोई कर्ज लेने जाए बैंक से तो उन्हें अपनी सब जमीन जायदाद गिरवी रखानी पड़ती है इनको लाखों करोड़ का कर्ज दिया गया तो कैसे दिया गया इन पर किन बैंकों पर या एल आई सी जैसी संस्था पर दबाव किसका था असली चीज तो ये है हु इज बिहाइंड ऑल दिस स्कैम तो जब तक जे पी सी के जरिए जांच नहीं होगी ये चीज आ नहीं सकती इसलिए हम लोग जे पी सी की मांग करते हैं And on your screens, as you can see, over the next few minutes, we're going to be bringing you visuals from the Lok Sabha and the Rajya Sabha. You can see uh, on your screens, Om Prakash Prilla on the left side of your screens, and the Vice President Jagdeep Dhankar on the right side of your screens. On left, the Lok Sabha, the right, the Rajya Sabha, slipping in, as you can see, into motion over there, into progress over there. Now, it remains to be seen how smoothly the day's proceedings are going to be going. My colleague Pallavi remains with us. Uh, Pallavi, visuals are about to start and I think on the left side we can actually hear uh, what the Lok Sabha speaker has to say and you can hear the rallying cries of what I believe is the opposition. What are they demanding Pallavi? मेरे चेंबर में आए बातचीत करें मैं हर मुद्दे पर हर बात पर आपको चर्चा कराने को तैयार हूं लेकिन आप चर्चा नहीं करना चाहते केवल बेल पे नाराबाजी करना चाहते हैं ये उचित नहीं है आप राजे आप मेरे चेंबर में आए किसी विषय पर मैं आपको चर्चा संवाद का पर्याप्त मौका दूंगा आप बेल में आकर नियोजित तरीके से सदन स्थगित करें ये उचित नहीं है फिर मान्य सदस्य में आपसे आग्रह करूंगा कि नारेबाजी करना देश की जनता के हित के लिए नहीं है देश की जनता ने आपको चुनकर भेजा है मजदूरों पे प्रश्न उठा पे आप मजदूरों के सवाल उठाने दो ना उनको आपके सदस्य वहां विराज ने आप बोलने नहीं दे रहे आप केवल नारेबाजी करने रोज सदन में भेजा है क्या आपको जनता ने देश की जनता आपको देख रही है उनके बुनियादी सवालों पर बात करो चर्चा करो मैं आपको पर्याप्त समय पर्याप्त अवसर दूंगा चर्चा और समाज पर हर मुद्दे पर माननीय राष्ट्रपति जी के अभिभाषण पर आप व्यापक चर्चा कर सक, कर सकते हैं नहीं गलत नारेबाजी करना भारत की संसद की मर्यादाओं के अनुरूप नहीं है आपने काफी वर्षों तक राज किया है इतनी पुरानी पार्टी है आप आपका इस तरीके का व्यवहार उचित नहीं है मान्य सदस्य के नेता प्लीज आप सीट पर जाइए मान्य सदस्य को प्रश्न पूछ दीजिए मैं मान्य सदस्य प्रश्न पूछना चाहते हैं मंत्री जी जवाब देना चाहते हैं सदन नहीं चलना देना चाहते आप आप सदन नहीं चलने देना चाहते सदन में चर्चा नहीं करना चाहते प्रश्नकाल पर सवाल नहीं उठाना चाहते सदन की कार्रवाई दो बजे तक के लिए स्थगित की जाती है